Hi there, Libra. Welcome to your September 2015 room scope with me. My name is Amanda. Um, you won't believe what card jumped out while I was shuffling. It's your card, the justice card. So that definitely wanted to be included. So they definitely are ready to speak to you, Libra. Let's see what they got to say. For September. And as always, I do just remind everyone to watch the video for your rising sign as well, because that can give you some additional information of uh, areas and other issues that you may be dealing with in September. The only way to get a reading though, only for you and any specific issues you may be struggling with is to schedule an appointment with me. I do those live on Skype. It's $65 for a 30 minute session. Just drop me a line at the email address in this video or below this video if you wanna set up an appointment. And that's roomscopes 4 you at gmail.com, a number four and the letter U at the end there. And uh, we'll get you set up. I did want to mention I will be offering one more online rune class this year. It's going to be November 2nd through December 7th. So if you haven't been able to sign up for the other classes up to this point, and you would like to learn how to read the runes for yourself and others, drop me a line at that same email address and I will add you to the roster. The deadline to sign up for that final class is October 29th. And also I wanted to welcome all of my new subscribers. I had quite a few uh, over the last few months. So welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for subscribing to Room Scopes. And if you haven't done so, go ahead and uh, just click the red button beneath this video or the, I'll put a link here in the video somewhere, wherever it is. And uh, you can click that and subscribe. Just make sure you're done watching the video before you click it because it will take you to the subscribe page. That way you get a notification whenever your new monthly video is uploaded and you don't have to kind of search for it. Um, you can just go right to it. But here, Libra, let me just take a look here. I, these are all in a line, which is very interesting to me, and I feel like I need to read them in a line. But your focus for the month of September with your card coming up has to do with being focused on balance, being focused on um, compromise, and a lot of this has to do with a group of people. Um, so this could be friends, family, coworkers, siblings, um, uh, people that you're collaborating with on a project, um, your family, your spouse, your children. There could be adjustments going on uh, in September that and compromises i'm getting the word compromise everybody working together compromising in order to bring more peace and more um wisdom to a situation and manas the rune that's coming up here also talks about support getting support from others um maybe maybe uh you know some of you may be seeking help uh through the legal system or uh seeking justice uh, through the legal system. And you will find a group, some of you may even be finding, yeah, a government situation or, or through legal means. You can get help with a situation or you can get, um, yeah, support in whatever way that you need it. Um, it's gonna be different for all of you because I'm not, I'm not getting a specific way. So that kind of tells me that it's gonna kind of funnel down to each of you in a different way in September. But so yeah, I mean, if there's a legal means, if you need help in some way and there is a legal um, or bureaucratic uh, organization that can help you or a government sort of organization that can help you, take advantage of that or, or definitely look into that because I feel like you will be meeting the right people in September or being able to contact the right people in September who can help you with that. Um, now Libra, many of you may be helping other people see uh, a situation. Maybe some of you work in the legal system or for, for a government institution, um, or you start that in September because uh, some of you may be the ones that are part of a group that helps others. And, and just, there's a coming together with manas that has to do with uh, humankind, human interaction, um, and, and supporting each other. So uh, on large and small scale, um, in September, Libra, that's going to be the theme. So you're going to be really in your element. Again, this is your this is your uh, tarot card. So um, 
I, I do feel like you'll be called on a lot to use that uh, gift you have for seeing all sides of a situation and seeing what compromise needs to be made to kind of bring everybody together here. Uh, to bring peace and happiness to a situation because, um, yeah, I feel like some of you, there may have been a disruptive event that's occurred this year and it may have kind of thrown a wrench into um, a family or group dynamic or work dynamic or, you know, your company um, because hail is coming up. Um, but if this happens, if it hasn't happened yet and it happens in September, it's going to be actually a positive thing. So because uh, hail is actually coming up next to Wunyo, which is the rune of joy. So there may be a very happy surprise, Libra for you in September. And it has to do with new beginnings, new growth. For some of you, it may be news of a birth or a pregnancy. Um, it may be news connected to mom or mom's side of the family or an older female in your family. Um, definitely, there's a lot of family and coming together around this and the joy that it brings. Um, and the Five of Pentacles is in reverse here. So, there may be this a struggle may be coming to an end or um yeah again a, a, an event that has been disrupted to the family or to people that you care about the people that you're close to will finally be resolved and maybe even legally uh for many of you and you know it'll finally be put to rest and there be, there will be cause to celebrate and everybody kind of coming together in, in a happier place um and in a happier way um but yeah, there is a lot, there are, uh, you know, there could be some news of births and new beginnings there. So if you don't want to get pregnant, Libra, and uh, you are female, um, definitely take precautions and men too. I mean, you know, because you, know, you, you can take precautions too. Um, you don't always have to leave it to the woman. Uh, in fact, we would appreciate it if you wouldn't. I don't know if I... That's just my opinion, but I have a feeling that some people will agree. The help that's going to be available to you. Um, you're no longer going to be dealing with issues from the past in the present. So because you have the, uh, the six of cups here in reverse. So it, that's like the nostalgia and the past. Those things are put to rest. Childhood's put to rest. There's a new way forward. So again, going back to this mother rune, a lot of you may be resolving issues with mom. Um, if, if you maybe didn't get along the best when you were younger or, you know, maybe this is your child and you've gone through a rough period. Maybe you just came through the rough teenage years with your own children and now you're coming out on the other side of that and kind of rebuilding or reconnecting uh, that relationship. Um, yeah, they're saying, you know, there, there may be some things that uh, you didn't know about that come out that really help you understand this person or this situation in a way that you haven't before. So for, yeah, for many of you, this could be mom or a mother figure, mother-in-law, maybe they went through a very difficult childhood and you know, that's caused them to be, um, you know, a, a certain way or, or not have tools that they need to. And, you know, sometimes maybe take it out inadvertently or advertently on other people, but maybe they didn't get those coping skills um, to deal with those things. But um, yeah, females will be an important part of, of September for you, Libra. And um, you may actually see a very intuitive side of someone that you didn't know was there, or maybe even a psychic side of someone that you didn't know was there. So, I mean, this could be, you could be talking to someone, maybe your mother, maybe the, this person you've had a difficult relationship with, your mother, your daughter, um, and they just say something that by the end of September or a little bit later on, it's gonna turn out to be very prophetic. It's like it's hidden from view. And then later you're gonna be like, how could they have possibly, how could she possibly have known that? Because I do feel like it's a female for most of you or a feminine male. Um, it could be a gay man also that, that this comes through, but it's gonna be like a wow moment. It's gonna be like, oh my God, how did he or she know that? Because there's, they, they, there's no way. Um, and this is gonna be helpful to you because again, this is coming up in the helpful position. Um, 
so yeah now some of you may be doing some spiritual work and there may be some information from past lives coming through in like a meditation or in dreams um you may find you know you may wake up and think god that was so vivid and i feel like i was there or I, you may have like a deja vu feeling even after you uh, you wake up or if it was a dream or kind of come out of your meditative state and um you should write that down definitely because there's something in that that's going to be again this is maybe your own intuition reaching out and helping you there's something in whatever this situation is if that's how this works for you or how this plays out for you um there's something in this past life situation that's going to help you in this life or um particularly when it comes to a relationship um and probably a family relationship for most of you now what can't be changed about september You've got Fehu, which is the rune of money. Yeah. Um, pay increase, raises, promotion, new job offers. Um, you've got that. You've also got the Page of Pentacles in reverse. This can sometimes be an earth sign child. It doesn't have to be, but we'll talk about that other, other uh, way this can work in a minute. But uh, So Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo child. Maybe somebody who's having trouble in school. So, I mean, if, if this is your child, maybe, yeah, they're, they're just um, having trouble focusing. Uh, and maybe with math, with Fehu coming up. Because, I mean, you know, that's a tough subject for a lot of people. I know it was tough for me. But so, yeah, maybe this, is, this child is normally a good student, but they're just really having problems with numbers or, um, yeah, anything dealing with numerics. Um, and... So I, I feel like there may be, though, help available. Maybe you're going to hire a tutor or you're going to have somebody come in and really work uh, with this child and, and uh, help him or her um, do better. Um, there may also be uh, something, I, there, I'm getting dyslexia. So some of you may be dealing with that and trying to find ways to help a child that has dyslexia with uh, not seeing, you know, being able to focus more because they have to kind of focus even more than than other kids in order to, you know, they see things one way and then they have to look, you know, until they see it the correct way. And sometimes they never do. So, I mean, some of you may be finding out, maybe you didn't even know that this was a problem. So you may get that information in September and then you can deal with it. You can take proactive steps to, uh, to helping this child. Now, if this is not a child or a young person around you, um, some of you may be teachers. That may be another way this is work. It, this works. It's telling me here that you, Maybe that's how you make your living. You're a, you're a teacher or you're a tutor, uh, a professor, and you're helping a young person who has who has a learning disability or who is having problems. Um, but I, I think you're going to find that rewarding. Some of you may be taking on tutor. Maybe you're a teacher during the day, but you're going to start tutoring also in the evenings to earn some extra money. I, I feel like those of you who are doing that, this is going to be very lucrative for you. Um, some of you may be considering going back to school and it may be the money or the cost that's kind of stopping you from doing that. Um, I do feel like, you know, in September, research, it's a good time to do research and, and there may definitely, again, going back to this justice card and what we started out with, maybe you qualify for like super low interest rate loans or, you know, maybe something about your um what you earn or your situation uh there's a group that can help you some of you may be able to go back to school and get reimbursement from your employer because i feel like if you just look research your options you'll find someone who will help you or you'll find a group or government uh program that will help you achieve this goal so that so that you can afford it essentially so that you can get money because <laughs> Fehu is about yes I'm gonna find a way to get money to go to school um, so yeah if you've really been wanting to do that go back to college or go you know take a course um, but you feel like you can't afford it look into uh, options because I feel like you could get either a great deal on a loan or maybe a family member or a friend would help you with this um, someone you're close to uh, would help you do this, would help you achieve this goal or a, a government institution. So yeah, don't give up on that. 
uh, if you're just willing to sit down and do some research, Libra, you may very well find that you qualify for assistance so that you can do this. Um, now, some of you may be investing. If, you, if you're looking to invest in September, um, this won't be something new. So maybe you're looking to increase your investment. It looks like the safest investment strategies in September would be to invest in something you already have money in, maybe just putting a little more towards that or something similar. Um, if you go off in a totally new direction or take a tip from someone about a new investment, that may not pay off as well as you would like. Because somebody may be like, yeah, it's brand new and it's not, you're not gonna get dividends right away, but eventually it's gonna pay off. It's like, well, how long are we talking? Um, stick with the tried and true when it comes to investments in September. That's what I would do based on the, these two together. Um, now by the end of the month with the two of rods, uh, some of you are going to be really feeling a lot more positive about your options and about what what course is available to you and really like like you're being helped in achieving your goals because you have thoracots here with the two of rods so it's like someone's helping you um launch your ships and not only that you know they're coming back with rewards so whatever the problem whatever the obstacle you're protected you've got a lot of luck around you too um, because that's what this rune talks about. Protection, luck, whatever your goal is, whether it be in a relationship scenario, whether it be a new job or a new investment, um, more money, promotions, raises, that sort of thing. Uh, I think you're going to feel a lot more positive about uh, whatever you start out in September, the main thing on your mind, again, your focus, getting support, getting help to achieve a goal or um, make something better, uh, that's really well start in September and your spirit guides are helping you big time with that, um, particularly when it comes to innovative ideas or you know um not feeling limited going outside or, or busting through any limitations and uh looking for new solutions to problems because if you just take the time to do that i feel like very quickly again kind of going back to this the the school example if you want to go back to school if you just do some research on the internet or maybe talk to uh your employer and and see what your options are there are going to be options available it's just Maybe you didn't realize they were there. You didn't know where to look, that sort of thing. Um, I feel like you just only have to take a small step in the direction of achieving your goal or getting help to achieve your goal, and you will receive it in September. So really awesome reading uh, for September, Libra. Good luck with that, and I will see you back here in October.